Okay, so let's look at question number 12, where we're asked to find the ratio of the circumference of two circles, but we instead are given the areas. So the areas are, and the areas are expressed in units of pi, 16 pi and 25 pi. So what we have to do is you have to understand what, from the lessons, what is the relationship between area and um, circumference? Okay, so area is a square unit, okay, and then circumference is a linear unit. Okay, so from the lessons they talk about how if you are trying to find the ratio of areas, you're looking at squared units, um, and if you're looking at uh, circumference, which is just like perimeter, we're looking at linear units. Okay, so the way you want to set this one up is we can express here the um, the ratio of the areas first okay so if we're going to look at the area and we want to find the ratios we can say that it's 16 pi divided by 25 pi okay that's the area ratio of the small one to the large one okay so pi's will cancel out so the area in this case is just 16 over 25 but if we were to convert that to a ratio where we're looking at circumference, okay, circumference is a linear measurement, okay, so it's different than area which is being square, so if we, circumference is going to be related to um, radius, okay, or we could just use the word circumference here, okay, and if we want to find what is the ratio of the circumferences, we need to undo the squaring that gives us the area. So circumference is going to be, the ratio for circumference is going to be the square root of 16 over the square root of 25, which is going to be 4 over 5. Okay, so the ratio of the two circles in terms of their circumferences is not going to be 16 by 25. It is going to be the square root of 16 and the square root of 25, which is 4, um, four to 5. Okay, so that's how you would look at, at question number 12, where you're going from area down to a linear measurement, okay, circumference, or another word for that would be perimeter. Okay, so perimeter, circumference, those are a single um, dimensional area that you, or a single dimensional value that you have to calculate. And if you're coming from area, you end up taking the square root of those values.